she, she's not here. Uh, she's at Bible study. I'm so serious about that. She is. She's at Bible study right now. But we're going to say happy birthday, Jillian, on three, because I want to mortify her. She can't stop me. She's not here. You guys ready? One, two, three. Happy, happy birthday, birthday, Jillian. Jillian. Oh, you guys are so obedient. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Ah, but that's enough about sisters. Let's talk about sex. Let's do it. Let's talk about sex, okay? Uh, I got a question here. Who, who, that I can see and easily communicate with, knows how to lock it down? Where are my guys that know how to get a woman? Where are you? Where are you? Are you shy or are you lying? Or is everyone here single? All of it? Okay. You guys are fun. What's your name? Me? Yeah, you. What's I'm your Joey. name? You're Joey. Hey, Joey. Joey, are you here with a significant other today? I am. You are. Hi, what's your name? She's like, oh my God. <laughs> Sophie. Sophie. Sophie and Joey. Sophie, is, is he all right? He's yeah. like, yeah, he's fine. cool guy. He's fine. He's fine. Tell me, he's Joey, fine. how? <laughs> he's fine. Oh my God. Tell me, Joey, how did you first broach romantic relations with Sophie? How did you get in? <laughs> not, and I'm not trying to be gross. Like, I'm not talking about, like, how did you hook up? Like, but how did you introduce the idea that you liked her in a way that is more than a friend? How'd you do it? Uh, well, we met on Tinder. Okay, I love it, I love it. It's a Message number two. Some circumstances have changed for me. Message number three. And I'd really like to bend you over if you still want some good cock. Joey, Joey, Joey. I'm gonna give you a little bit of context here, you ready? Joey, I got this message while I was talking to my now former therapist about whether or not I attract toxic men, Joey. Okay? Joey, how did he do? I'm sure it's locked it down. You think he got it? You think that, yeah, yeah? You think he did? Anyone else? Like, anyone, like, applause if you really liked that method? Oh my god! Oh, ew. Okay, all right, okay. Well, I will tell you all this. He did not succeed. But, uh, Who's sorry for him? Fuck all y'all. Fuck all y'all. Whoever's like, aw, poor guy. He really worked for that. No, he didn't. Stop yourselves right there. Stop yourselves. But I will tell you, ladies and gentlemen who have received those similar text messages, how I responded. Take a second, grab your phone, take notes if you need to, uh, ask for some paper real quick, because I think this was really good, and it was deep. Ah, oh, he's got the paper. This, this is my guy. What is your name? Jesse. Jesse. Okay, Jesse is going to learn today. Are you ready? Okay, so first I went gift searching, right? I went looking for a good gif. And I found a gif of a wily coyote looking with binoculars out over a vast, arid, barren canyon because I like deep symbolism. Uh, and if you don't get that, that's a pussy joke. That's a dry pussy joke. All y'all are like, Ugh. so I sent him this gift, right? Binoculars, Wiley e. Coyote, looking out over this vast canyon, um, and I just sent that, no context. I let it sit for a minute, right? You gotta let it sit, let it fester, let him wonder what's going on. And then I followed up with this message: Excuse me for one second while I look for who exactly the fuck you think you're talking to, and that's how you do it. I have one. Thank you. Thank you. Fucking thank you. I do have one last quick question for you guys, and then I'm gonna get out of here. Uh, we're gonna show by round of applause and raucous cheering. Ra I demand raucous cheering, like don't give me some subpar shit. Commit to it, okay? Do I send it to his mom? <laughs> it was awesome to watch as it was awesome to watch as all the men were like, have I ever sent something to Amanda that shouldn't go to my mom? But you guys are great. I'm gonna text his mom later. Thank you so much and have